Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm back with another haul video. I feel like it's been a little while since I've done a haul, but in reality it probably hasn't. But since I feel that way, this is going to be pretty big. I've got a few different types of items, some planners obviously, also some accessories, and I even have a giveaway or two uh, snuck up in this video. So be sure to watch. I hope that you enjoy, and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right in. So I'm going to go ahead and kick off this haul video with some planner accessories. I do have quite a few, and this is actually a leftover that I forgot to include in my haul from when I came back from Florida, so I'll have that linked up above if you're interested. I did pick this up while I was down there. This is an embellished glittery letter K, and I got this at Hobby Lobby for $1.99, probably 50% off of that. And I picked this up because I really love monogramming things with my initials or my full monogram, and I've seen a lot of people use these stickers um, in their traveler's notebooks so I did get a traveler's notebook so you'll be seeing that in a future video very soon but for so cheap I decided to pick one up and I love that this one is a gold glitter so I'm super excited to put this probably on like one of my pockets or on a clear dashboard in my traveler's notebook. The next accessory that I have to share with you guys is some more washi by Simply Gilded. I feel like all of my last few haul videos have featured something from Irene's shop because she makes some of the most beautiful washi and as you can see I picked up some more bow washi. I just wanted to show you first that my order came with this adorable little journaling card. It says you jelly and it's got a silver foiled kawaii jellyfish so that is very very pretty for summertime. I picked up two different items, well, two different collections of items. First, I picked up this uh, bow washi here. I'm sorry, I forgot to take it out of the packaging. So this is a very sort of light, minty blue green. It's a kind of a difficult color to describe, but it's beautiful, and it's got like this champagne gold bow. So I picked this up by itself, and I'm sure that you could probably still grab it in her shop. And then I went ahead and picked up this set here. This is called the Tropical Set, and uh, when she first released them, she was offering it as a bundle with this diamond pen. I've been collecting a lot of these, and this one is a beautiful hot pink with a uh, little gold diamante across the top. So I got to bundle them together for a pretty good price. And this is the Tropical Bow Washi set, like I mentioned. So we've just got four fun summer colors. We have this beautiful true pink, and it's a little bit like of a rosy shade with a gold bow. Then we have this really pretty leafy, almost like palm tree colored green with the bows again. Then we have two here in silver, this one being a sort of medium blue with a silver bow, and then this gorgeous yellow with a silver bow. I kind of wish it was a gold bow, but I love the yellow nonetheless. So bright and perfect for summertime. So super happy that I got to bundle them together. I believe that this is still available in her shop, but it might not all be a bundle. It might just be like the tropical washi and then the pen separately, but you should still be able to get your hands on this. So super excited to have some more bow washi in my collection from Simply Gilded. The next item that I have to share is from a new to me shop. This shop is called Lauren Phelps Designs and this is her beautiful business card here, so fun and bright. And it says here that she specializes in high quality, one of a kind, vibrant and inspirational items for home, office, and planners of all types. So she's on Etsy and I actually made a small order during the PBC sale in the springtime. And usually when shops participate in those bigger sales, their wait times are a little bit extended so uh, I did have to wait for this a little while but it was completely understandable so I did get a planner cover but before I show you that I do want to show you that my order actually came with a few extras she included this beautiful fabric uh, clip here, really cute. I've seen a lot of people put these in their traveler's notebooks, and this is a fun minty pattern, so that was really sweet to get that for free. And then also for free, we have this print here, and this says a gift for you, perfect addition to your planner, art journal, Bible, or traveler's notebook, five by seven art print that you can flip over. This fun print can be used in your home or office as well as in your planner. So you could frame this or put this, um, make this a dashboard if this is a size planner that you have. Um, so this is really, really pretty. It's got all of these watermelons. I believe that most of her art is original. This kind of looks like a bloomsicle pattern, but sometimes people incorporate both, but that's really fun and it says stay sweet. 
and I just picked up one planner cover. I thought that this was really beautiful. It is this gorgeous floral pattern with some keys, very secret garden to me, and I got it customized with my name in a faux uh, rose gold glitter, so I think that's beautiful, um, and it's the same sort of lamination as Erin Condren covers, so I'm excited to pop this on, especially in the fall time. The insides are also printed, so we've just got like the top florals, which is really beautiful. Not all shops do the inside, and I love the sort of spotty pattern. Then the back uh, has her logo, and then just the same pattern with a little bit more um, accent there because my name isn't there. So this is really gorgeous, and she has a lot of different sizes. I think she even does traveler's notebooks and different planners, so really happy to have this in my collection. Next to share with you guys, I've got some beautiful new pen gems. Here first we have the new Stargazer collection, and I apologize because this actually released on June 26th, but I did check and these are all still available for $9 each in the shop. I just don't think that you can get the set together, so I apologize about that, but I will go through them and let you know uh, what the pens are and what they're called. So this is the Stargazer collection. And um, if you know Angel, the owner of Pen Gems, she's really into Guardians of the Galaxy and stuff like that. So I thought that this was really appropriate for her. So this is a collection of five new Pen Gems. And each of them has a fun sort of intergalactic name. This first one, well, first of all, they're all done with a frosted black enamel. I'm reading it off the card to make sure that I've got it right. All done with a frosted black enamel and um, crystal blend inspired by the night sky. So I, it also seems like they've got some chrome silver on them, which is really gorgeous. And they each have a black topper, which is super shiny and pretty. So we have five here. The first one here is called Andromeda, and it's got pink and black crystals inside. Let me get real close there so you can see. Super gorgeous. Then we've got Equinox here, which is the blue, again, with the black crystals. Then we have Milky Way here, which is white and black crystals. We have Supernova, which looks like super hot and fiery, which has like red and orange crystals inside of it. And then lastly, we have Ultraviolet, which has purple and black crystals inside of it. So these are super cool, um, especially I think this one here, which is called Milky Way, would look really gorgeous if you're into like monochromatic marble type spreads. So classy and chic and very pretty. And to apologize for having shared this with you guys so late in the game, although these are still available, I'm actually going to be giving away this set uh, to one person. So if you would like to win this set of Stargazer Pen Gems, uh, go ahead and leave me a comment down below letting me know what's your favorite video that I create. Let's just do something like that. And I will put the uh, rules and the end date in the description down below because I still have to figure that out mentally but they're really gorgeous and you can also go ahead and pick up this notebook here I think it's stone paper I have to double check but it's three dollars and it's this really cute grid uh, sort of inside and I think that this is stone paper so it um, doesn't wear away if you get it wet or something like that so that's super cool and you can pick that up as a cute little add-on to your collection so again if you'd like to win this go ahead and read the rules down below and uh, one of you might be getting the set in the mail soon continuing with pen gems I actually have another very very special pen to share with you guys I actually had the honor of creating and designing my third uh, designer pen gems in collaboration with Angel of pen gems and we created together this absolutely gorgeous pen I'll zoom in a little bit so this is my third designer pen gems and these are all limited edition 
Angel will often have uh, friends of hers and people in the planner community design pens. And this is my third one, so I'm super excited. And this is extra special because this is actually the very first printed pen gems that there has ever been. I have a ton of pen gems, a lot of them, most of them I believe, and all of them just feature a solid colored barrel and all different colors under the sun. You can get anything that you like, but I have the absolute honor of debuting the very first printed one. So as you can see, this is done in a black and white polka dot, um, and the crystals themselves are a mixture of different shades of pink. Then on top we have this beautiful sort of rose shimmery stone. So I am incredibly excited to be sharing this with you and I feel so honored and so special to have created another pen and also to kind of start something new with the pattern pen gem. So this is awesome. These have not released yet. They will be releasing this Friday, June, no, not even June, July 7th. And I will put the details um, in a little strip here so that you guys can see. And for another giveaway, I am going to be giving away one of these pens here on YouTube. So if you'd like to enter to win this pen, go ahead and you can leave me the same um, comment about what kind of video you'd like to see. I will just choose two people randomly, one to win the Stargazer collection and one to win this pen here. And if you're interested, I'll also be giving away a pen in my Facebook group. The link is down below. And I'll also be giving one away on Instagram. So go ahead and check out all of those platforms and be sure to enter across all of those different sites for even more chances to win this pen. So super excited and um, I can't even express how happy I am to have done this again. Following up those beautiful pens, I have another gorgeous item to share with you. This obviously is from the Planner Society because it's in this beautiful Planner Society Girl little drawstring bag with the Planner Society Girl up front. So I sign up for Planner Society emails since I am, um, what am I called? I'm a member of the subscription. So. I have been trying to get into the world of traveler's notebooks recently and I know that a lot of people who subscribe to the Planner Society are big traveler's notebooks fans. So before I decided to bite the bullet and really invest in an expensive leather traveler's notebooks, I got an email from the Planner Society that they were going to be releasing a limited edition traveler's notebook little bundle. Now this is a faux leather and this is a pocket size I believe. And this was only about 20 to $25 total. And I figured that this would be a fun introduction to the Traveler's Notebook world. So I'm really excited to have gotten this. It's got this really gorgeous um, floral pattern and these pinks and purples. And then we have a pink elastic here. So it functions just like any other Traveler's Notebook. Again, this is a faux leather. So this is the front. Then you go inside and you've got your pockets in the front and back. The inside is done with this beautiful sort of bronzy rose gold heart pattern, which is very pretty. And then you actually do get another elastic so that you can go ahead and add some more um, notebooks to your traveler's notebook. I'll actually put this aside. And what I didn't realize was actually that this came with its own insert. So a really great deal considering how affordable this was. So first we have this beautiful Live What You Love insert with the Planner Society girl on it and all of the colors match. This one is a sort of, you could keep this for any sort of time period, a day, a week, a month. It says be you and then the sections are must do, can't forget to do, notes, personal, this week. So you have a whole notebook full of those. Then you have this pretty floral print notebook and this just has a grid pattern and across the top of each uh, page it says hello beautiful in that really pretty Planner Society font. And then lastly, we have this notebook here, and this one is more of a blank insert with the Planner Society Girl, and across the top it says, Be Fabulous. So again, really versatile, and I believe, okay, so this notebook came with three elastics, one for each, 
notebook that it came with but I believe that with the extender you can probably make it go up to four or five I'm still not very well versed when it comes to extenders so I thought this was a great deal for less than $25 uh, to kind of get you introduced to it and of course you can change these notebooks out and use your own inserts I think that this will be really pretty in the fall so I'm really excited about that I know that she Christy of the Planner Society doesn't do do these too often excuse me but she does, she has done them before, and a lot of times she will design custom traveler's notebooks and planners and do pre-orders for them. So you might have to wait a while, but they're usually really well priced, they're vegan leather, and uh, they're really unique and gorgeous. So I definitely suggest that you check them out. So just continuing on the planner bandwagon, I actually have another planner to share with you guys. This is a personal size planner that I purchased off of a Facebook group. A really sweet girl that I followed on Instagram for a long time has been going through some struggles recently uh, with one of her newest babies and um, she was going ahead and selling most of her planner collection on Facebook to try to raise some funds. So I definitely felt like this was a great time to kind of um, help somebody out and then in the process I did gain a really really beautiful planner so this is actually something that I had been looking for so the timing was great but of course if you could keep her in your thoughts and her family in your thoughts that would be great so what I picked up from her little D stash is this gorgeous personal size planner. It is this absolutely beautiful shade of a peachy pink and it's hard to describe. It's it's like a peach with like a touch more pink than anything else. And I was definitely looking for something like this. I have a few personal planners but most of them are pastel pink. And I was looking for something just a little bit brighter for the summertime. But I didn't want to go overboard. So this is actually perfect. I'm so happy with this color. This uh, planner is by the brand Paper Durable, which I believe is based in Malaysia. So anybody that's in Asia out there might have simpler access to it, but I think anybody can buy it, of course. Um, in terms of the leather, it feels like a real leather, and it is very, very, very similar to a Kiki K leather. Honestly, if uh, that logo wasn't different, I truly would have uh, believed that this was a K uh, Kiki K, excuse me. So it is just a personal size planner and we've got pockets in here. So that's the brand Paper Adorable and the little logo is like a little heart. And this seems to be completely brand new. It doesn't look like she used it at all. The rings are gold and the entire thing is the same color. And then we've got these really pretty inserts. Unfortunately, they are for 2016, but if you're interested in picking up this planner, I don't know if this exact one is still available, but I did check out the website and I believe that their sort of insert aesthetic is very similar with the watercolors and the really pretty quotes. So you can check those out. And I know that they also have other sort of stationary supplies and stuff like that too so I'm really excited to move into this for the summertime I think that it's bright but it's not like super in your face and um, I was super happy to help somebody out and get a new planner in the process so I will link the paper adorable site down below this next purchase here is technically a planner accessory, but it did come along with stickers that I ordered at the same time, so I'm going to use this time to sort of segue into the sticker section of this haul. Stickers are always my favorite part of a haul to watch, even though I go ahead and I buy all the other stuff too. I always love seeing stickers the most. So this here is a planning pad from Hello Petite Paper. She released this in her shop, and I got one in March or so as part of one of her mystery kits and it was a beautiful sort of spring and Paris theme and I have been loving it so much that when I saw that she released a second version I had to pick it up so this is a, a planner pad and it says planning my week we've got sections from Monday through Sunday next week a blank section and then a little note section this goes along with her secret garden kit and artwork so you can go ahead and pick up the matching kit for this if you'd like I did do a spread on it so I will link that up above as well this is so great I love using these to pre-plan my weeks before I sit down and film and it's awesome because you can just go ahead and rip off the page toss it and then you're on to a fresh start again so super happy to have this in my collection and I wouldn't be mad if she kept making new ones because I will definitely keep getting them 
Hey guys, so I apologize if this next section of the haul seems super out of like time and place. I'm actually filming this at a completely different time than the rest of the haul, a lot earlier actually, because I am about to use what I'm about to show you in a plan with me that I'm going to film right after this. So I should be fitting this in with the rest of the items from Hello Petite Paper. And what I have here is a kit and this is called the Good Vibes Kit. And it's a really gorgeous kit and I have a few different components of it here. First, we have this little functional sheet with um, little coordinating functional stickers like coffee cups and bathtubs and a car and a book bag, all with the same artwork from the kit. So it matches perfectly. Then we have the coordinating glitter headers. These floral headers, which are really pretty and I'm hoping to use. We have all of this gorgeous deco. This is all hand drawn, of course, and it's got like a nautical vibe with the little anchors and the purses and the bows and some more of those floral headers. As far as the kit goes, first here we have the header sheet. So beautiful. I always love Vanessa's headers because a lot of them have the print uh, thrown into them, which I think is so unique. Here we have the heart checklist, and again, so pretty because some of them have patterns in them. This is the half boxes and little things sheet, so beautiful. These are the awesome full boxes. The quote box says, good vibes only. I love the little denim shorts with the little bralette, and then the girl with the bow in her hair. I think that that's super gorgeous, and the bows as well. Then we have the washi sheet, which is like that double layered sort of effect washi, some strips, a weekly box, and then a habit tracker. And then lastly, I do have this little freebie that matches perfectly as well. This is on matte, although the kit is in glossy and it's so pretty in the glossy. Uh, but this one has a quote box that says, start each day with a grateful heart. We've also got a matching movie marquee and then a few more of those coordinating deco items. So I'm super excited to be using this in like 30 seconds and I will go ahead and show you the rest of the items that I picked up from Hello Petite Paper right now. At this point, I'm assuming that you've seen my little clip from the other day. I will link the Plan With Me video that I did using the Good Vibes kit from Hello Petite Paper up here. It was just this past week, but I did want to show you that the last thing that I picked up from Hello Petite Paper was actually the matching monthly kit. This is the July monthly kit and it features the same artwork uh, that Vanessa made uh, from the Good Vibes kit. So her monthly kits are a bit smaller, but they're really pretty, and you can't get over that original artwork. So this is the top section for the planner. It says July, we've got the camera and the girl with that beautiful bow. We also have some strips here to mark out larger periods of time. Here we have some sidebar checklists, some headers that you could use, glittery labels, and then some icons. And then lastly, we have this little functional sheet with some uh, whited out in the center full boxes that you could use decoratively or functionally. These glitter sections that can be used to cover up the parts of the month that are not in July. Some payday flags, a happy 4th of July sticker, some balloons, luggage, cars, and airplanes. So that is everything that I picked up from Hello Petite Paper. Gorgeous as always and super happy to support Vanessa and her shop. Next, I'm really excited to be sharing with you guys two separate orders made within days of each other from one of my favorite shops, and that is Little Miss Papery. Brittany did participate in the Planner Addict, what, the Planner Boss Collective sale, and then just a few days later, she participated, or she had a Mother's Day promo going on, so it was like I had no choice. So I will show you everything that I picked up together. So first with each of my orders, I did get a really pretty journaling card. This first one says, character is how you treat those who can do nothing for you. And then the second one says, 10 years from now, make sure you can say that you chose your life and didn't settle for it. So very inspirational and very pretty. And you can use these in your planners or frame them, or you can be really creative with them. First, I'll share with you guys my Planner Boss Collective Sale order. And as part of the Planner Boss Collective Sale, she did have this really gorgeous exclusive freebie. This features some really gorgeous floral papers that I believe she's going to use to make a birthday kit soon. And this is a really great size with a full box, little deco, a floral laptop, 
quarter box build do sticker this adorable little miss papery munchkin and it's going to be so hard for me not to use that but i only have one so it's uh, this is like really going to be difficult for me we also have some other functional stickers like a tv a laptop a mailer that's what <laughs> an envelope that's what it's called a battery is it friday yet hello her little crown and then a let's go shopping sticker so this is super super cute so as part of the planner boss collective sale i just picked up one kit and these are items from the lemonade kit i don't know if this is still available in her shop i'm sorry if it's not and i also don't remember if i got the mini kit or just some pieces of the kit i can never remember but i do know that as part of the kit she did uh, include this little freebie and it coordinates with the colors and i think that's what she's starting to do now like give you freebies that match your kit and then in the same sort of paper that you get so this is a glossy freebie with a laptop rescheduled nope a little set of bullet points two dollar tuesday is it friday yet and then some other stickers here so again this is lemonade first i got the lemonade glitter headers and i love britney's glitter headers because they just look so shiny and i'm really excited because this is the new format of her two-page base kit this has changed quite a bit so this sheet is probably the most different we now have three heart checklists some little fork and knife stickers which i am super excited about some flags three laptops three tvs a lot of these little cutout icons like trash cans shopping bags money signs a lotus for something like yoga a box a little like flexing bicep which is very cute rubber ducky some shopping bags and alarm clocks We've got a smaller assortment of icons uh, because most of them were replaced by those cutout icons, which I do prefer. Weekend banner, one weekend banner in a, like a scripty font, a payday sticker, a girls night sticker, laundry day, laundry day number two, takeout, which I also really like because I love doing takeout. I do more takeout than I do date night, but we do still have the date night sticker. Let's go shopping, family time, one daily chore circle, which again, I am very happy about because I found those a little difficult to use. The coffee cup, envelope, planner, lazy day circle, uh, balloons, a me time sticker, a movie marquee, which has gotten a little smaller, which is probably the only thing that I'm sad about, but it's really not much of a difference. And then a second weekend banner. So this is awesome because it includes so, so much. Then this second sheet here has also gotten a change. We now have seven half boxes and then seven quarter boxes, three habit trackers, two build do stickers, some of these blank little things a next week font sticker and a this week font sticker which i think is really cute for the sidebar a weekly box a larger flag and then some uh sidebar headers i really love the happy mail one and the dinners one so i really love this format and i think it's going to work so well for me then here i do just have the washi page we've got both the uh, thicker washi which is not too thick and then also some skinny strips which you can use in like your horizontal or whatever you'd like to do you can layer them on top of these the washi strips and then a little bit of deco that hello sticker and then uh, some bullet points and stuff like that then lastly we have the full boxes which are so cute and i love lemons and i love that this isn't too blue with the yellow it's got a lot of purple which i think is very pretty this quote box says easy peasy lemon squeezy and this one says life is good and then you get five i was gonna say seven my goodness five blank quarter boxes to go along with that so really love this kit and i think that it's perfect for summertime for something a little bit softer and then so kind of Brittany, she actually included an extra little mini kit with my order, which I was just blown away by. You guys know that I love Little Miss Papery, and she takes such a good care of her people that I am so floored by this. She included... Um, the new like little miss papery anniversary kit she re-released it in her shop and she redid it in the new format so i used this kit back in february i think so i'll link that up above but i'm really excited to have it in the new format um i didn't have glitter headers last time so i'll definitely be using this again and again we have that freebie the glitter headers the two-page base kit here which is so gorgeous then we have the full boxes, which I think are mostly the same. I know that this quote box is the same, and this one probably is too. And then lastly, we have the bottom washi and then the deco. So very similar, but it's super fun to have this in the new format. 
then lastly from Little Miss Papery, I actually have the last kit that she made in her previous format. So you can go ahead and kind of see uh, what the differences are. This is called the Aloha kit. And because it was the last kit in that format, it didn't have a coordinating freebie. So this one is actually just done um, in the lemonade color. So happy to have an extra of that. And I just went ahead and picked up a few sheets from this kit. I really liked these colors. They were summery, definitely, but still super soft, and it wasn't, like, so bright in my face. So really like that. This first sheet has icons, checklists, half boxes, and then some of those really pretty functional stickers. This sheet has the washi strips, some headers, a full box that says Aloha, some quarter boxes, a sidebar sticker, and then just a few of those cutout stickers. So you can go ahead and see how that has changed quite a bit, right? You get another uh, weekend banner and then so many more functional stickers. And um, I just think it'll work out a lot better for me. Then here we have the full boxes sheet, which is very, very cute, uh, super soft, a lot of that soft yellow and peach that I love. And this quote here says, ocean air, salty hair, which is very cute. Then lastly, we have the half boxes, the bottom washi, washi strips, and then some really cute deco. So I think that this is perfect for any point in the summer. And again, I like that it's a little bit softer than other summer kits. So that is everything from Little Miss Papery. Next, I have an order from a new to me shop, and this is Lexi Kylie Designs. I know that a lot of people really love this shop, and she's got some great functional stickers and a really fun kit setup. So I decided to go ahead and pick up her July mystery kit. Uh, this little sort of uh, intro says summer is finally here. I know I'll be spending it at the poolside. Hope you love this one. Enjoy XO Lexi. So I was seeing some sneaks on her Instagram of this kit and I liked what I was seeing. So I decided to pick it up. Uh, here we have her fun foiled business card. Uh, Lexi Kylie Designs. Then as part of the kit, uh, we did get one freebie, which is this coordinating little journaling card, which is very cute and says good vibes. Then uh, the second freebie is actually this Lexi Kylie Designs freebie, so it just coordinates with the kit, and it says freebie because sometimes you need a few extras to plan a second week. Enjoy. So that's really great. Uh, these are some things that you might want to use in a second spread, like another weekend banner, another payday sticker, trash day, laundry day, some quarter boxes, a little cell phone and planner, bill due, and some habit trackers. Then this kit did come with coordinating glitter headers. So we've got what looks like a few different textures here, a gold glitter, two pinks, and a teal. So first I have here this really fun functional sheet as part of this kit. This has some really awesome functional stickers. Let me zoom out a bit. First we have a quote box that says summer with two habit trackers, full set of checklists, a day off sticker, a bill due sticker, fun functional stickers like a gas pump, a car, a coffee cup, dumbbell, a little uh, medical appointment, stethoscope, that's what it's called, some balloons, a lazy day sofa, a movie night sticker, a laundry night, even a midweek spread sticker. So really, really fun. And I love that everything is done with the patterns dropped into it. I think that that's really unique. And I forgot to mention that she has what's something that's called like unicorn paper. And this is just a really nice sort of papery premium mat, if you're wondering. So really fun and vibrant. Next, we have this half boxes sheet, which has a mini triple heart checklist, a weekly box, a canceled sticker, a banner. Then we've got eight half boxes and then six quarter boxes and then some washi strips. Here is the bottom washi sheet. This is a little bit more on the simple side with this sort of a pool watery sort of washi, which I think is very fun. We've got what are actually washi strips, but if you layer them together, you can definitely make those into full boxes. So that's pretty cool. Then we have the full box heart checklist, which are a little bit on the simpler side, which is great because everything in this kit is so color coordinated and really quite busy, but I really like that. Then we've got another weekly box and then two more of those mini heart checklists and then some more washi strips. This sheet here has two sets of date covers and date dots, more half boxes, a quarter box, and then some more deco. Here we have a full set of headers, and I really love the font that she used for this. I think I'll definitely be using these headers when I do the spread. Then some really gorgeous little things that have touches of glitter on them, which I think is precious. Then lastly, we have the full boxes. So we have nine here, 
10 with the one on the other page. This quote box says, there is sunshine in my soul, which is very, very pretty. Love the pineapples. And then these little quarter boxes with the glittery flag. So I really like this kit. It is quite bright, but I think that I can make it work if I go ahead and pick and choose and um, combine this with some simpler stickers from my collection. But really, really enjoy this. Her paper is lovely. And I love that she really puts forth an effort to make this something that you can spread over multiple weeks and you don't have to sort of use it once. You get a lot of bang for your buck. So really fun from Lexi Kylie Designs. And while I'm at it, I'll go ahead and share an order from another new shop to me. This shop is called Little Indigo Papery, and I've been following her for quite some time. Really love her stuff, and I just wanted to share how beautifully my order was packaged. This little uh, paper sort of pamphlet has my name on it, and it says, Thank you so much. Your Little Indigo Papery order is here. Then this is what the inside looks like, and it is so cute. I did open it up, but I went ahead and put everything back so you could see. Here we have the little freebie, and this actually coordinates with some of the stickers that I got. Then we have a rewards card. Get a $10 shop credit for every five orders. Look for the rewards sticker on your freebie. Once five empty spots are filled, send me a picture of your card to receive your credit. So that's always really fun. An incentive to go ahead and buy some more. Then we have the actual stickers. As you can see, I kind of massacred it when I was trying to rip it out, but really, really, really cute. These were wrapped in a cello bag, and then they had this gorgeous lace over top, but I got rid of the cello bag and just kept the lace. It also came with this really cute little today uh, bookmark that I would go ahead and laminate, and you can use this in your traveler's notebook or any planner. So like I mentioned, this did come wrapped in some really pretty lace. And I actually picked up one kit, but she was nice enough, her name is Hannah, to go ahead and include a second kit for me. So really excited to share that with you. First, we have the Blush Blooms kit, which I think is very pretty. And this is the kit that I picked up. These are the full boxes. We've got some really pretty florals. This quote that says, choose to be happy. Then we've got this pretty girl with like her top knot and the flowers in her hair. Super pretty. And I actually think that this would be really nice for fall. This sheet comes with some date covers and then some bottom washi and washi strips. We have this functional sheet here with some headers, a habit tracker, some more washi strips and quarter boxes, a scallop box, a weekly box, some page flags, and some build you stickers. And this is on her uh, premium mat and this is another one of those more papery. It's kind of like papery and rubbery. It's just like a really nice matte paper, I'll say that. Then we have this sheet which has eight square half boxes and all of your little things as well as some extra headers that you could use in your sidebar. I love that some of the little things have the pattern dropped in them. Then we have another functional sheet which has some scallop checklists, some more flags, some icons, a weekend banner, some more quarter boxes, some hexagons, a coffee cup, and then a planner. And then lastly, we have here the heart checklist with the pattern in the background and some more quarter boxes and washi. So again, that was the Blush Blooms kit. And she was kind enough to also include the Enchanted Floral kit. This one is all purple with bows and florals. And this quote says, find the beauty in every day. So I'll go through it a little bit more quickly. That way you guys can just see. Here are the bottom washi and date covers, the headers, and then some functional stickers half boxes and little things, and then the checklist flags and functional stickers. And lastly, the heart checklist. And this is really pretty and purple and super fun and I really, really like it. So that's everything from Little Indigo Paper. We really like what I got. Lastly, to finish off this haul, I have a really fun new sort of innovative kit from one of my favorite shops, Shop Jessica Hart. So this is the Girl on the Go planning system. So not the name of the kit, but this is her planning system, which is something that I've seen her debut on her channel, and it's something that I've never seen anywhere else, and I think that it is super, super fun. Jessica does do uh, Plan With Me videos, and she will also use her channel to share things related to her shop, so you should definitely check that out. So this is the Girl on the Go planning system, and this specific kit is called Wild. So this is Wild Girl on the Go. So before I show you this little sheet here, let me show you what the system is like. So basically you get a few sheets of stickers here. I'll try and show you like three of them all together without getting my tripod into it. Yeah, there we go. So these three 
and basically this is your full spread and each of these stickers are actually strips that you just lie down in a strip and basically create a full no white space spread super super quickly so let me show you so this is all one giant strip and each strip basically has your ombre mason jar checklist this time. Then you also get a glitter header, again all combined, and then this sort of full box section. This time around she did include the pattern to go all the way down to the bottom. So then you also get this really awesome sidebar sticker. We get a, a quote box that says Wild at Heart a this week uh, weekly box, two habit trackers, and then a little half box that says goals. And this again is just one sticker. So you can just go ahead and put down this whole thing in your sidebar, which is so, so cool. Then on this sheet over here, you do get some little things. These are cut out individually. It's not like a whole strip of little things, but the idea is that you can go ahead and then just place these down where you need them and just create something super customized, but still really fast and efficient. You do also get some other sheets with this kit. You get this sheet here, which is the bottom washi, which is just like regular bottom washi. Actually, it's not like regular bottom washi. I'm wrong. Both of these strips are the same length, so everything lines up across the bottom like this, if that makes any sense. So this goes all the way into the sidebar, and then you just continue this straight on up. You also get some quarter boxes, half boxes, flags, and then odds and ends headers should you want to use them in your full boxes. And then you also get one last sheet of half boxes putting you at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven, one for each day. Um, and then a fourth quarter box and then two of these flag boxes and some icons. So this is really, really cool. And I think this is a great solution to those of you um, who are just still figuring things out, getting kind of getting your footing when it comes to decorative planning. Or if you just have a really busy lifestyle, love to be decorative, but just